today I want to talk to you about life insurance. Actually, I'd like to have a chat with you about why people don't like to talk about life insurance. It's a very common problem and here are some thoughts. And let me ask you if this sounds like you. Number one, it reminds me of my mortality. Yep, you're absolutely correct. Life insurance does do that. And remember what Ben Franklin said, there's only two absolutes in life, death and taxes. Number two, it's a subject that's morbid and boring. You know what? Realistically, neither one of those are true. And here's the hot tip. Taking care of your family should be your number one priority. And life insurance is a very important piece of that mission. Number three, and I hear this a lot, it's complicated and I don't know where to get started. Well, lots of things in life are complicated. But what do we do in all those situations? You go out and you get an education. So you need to read some books, surf the web, ask your friends, and most important of all, go find a great insur insurance agent to give you that education. Number four, uh, money is tight and I can't afford it right now. Or number five, I'm young, I'm healthy, I don't need life insurance. All right, let's cut the crap. Let's all admit most of us are scared to talk about life insurance. You know what? I was too. But I had a great life insurance coach help work me through all of my questions. You need to take the time to sit down and figure out what's important to you. Okay, let's be a little dramatic. Let's say you drop dead before you see the end of this video. That's pretty dramatic. And I want you to think about it. Is your family all set with the mortgage and potential college loans coming up or uh, different paying down of, of your, all your expenses? And most important of all, is there a nest egg at the end of the line once you pass away? Here's a takeaway. Could your family live in the same house and in the same lifestyle as they have today if you passed away today? If you answered no to any of those questions, you need to start to think about life insurance. Take the time and start to think about all your major expenses and how they're going to be covered when you're gone. 